hello my beautiful people you are welcome back to my youtube channel and it's your girl flora again in today's video i'm back again with this our super amazing spiritual guide i want to guide you i want to share with everybody who watch my video right now just mixing lemon and rice you will thank me for the rest of your life I know that there's a lot of people out there. They want to ask me how the things is really work. If you are mixing a lemon and rice, let me tell you, there is a spiritual power of mixing these two things together. Among those spiritual power, I want to share with you into this video. So you will need to watch this video until the end. And I will guide you exactly on how you can mix it lemon and rice this way when you at home before you're about to do this before you're about to chant to meditate and also to pray to work for you as it work for others i recommend you if you are just new member to this channel down below please consider to subscribe to my youtube channel if you didn't subscribe to my youtube channel and you are a returning member to this channel thank you so much guys for always passing by don't forget to like this video and share this video with some friend family and other groups and telling them you can do this our amazing spiritual tips joining to my membership video in order to support me support the channel and if in case you really need to make this channel growing you can do so by joining through my membership video or by give this video amazing super thanks it doesn't matter about your religion because in having the power to make things happen. You're having the vibration inside in yourself to make things come into you. You're having the energy inside in your body to make things flow into you. So when you manifest, just believe in it. In Matthew 17, 20, it say, when you're having a faith, you're moving a mountain from one place to another place. So let's dive in in today's video, how you can do it how you can manifest with this one. Step number one, find a comfortable area. When I'm talking about the comfortable area, just the area which there is no noise. It can be in your sitting room, your dining area, or even in your kitchen. So it doesn't matter. After you are done getting the comfortable area, remember also to choose the best time to do it. The best time to do this, the super amazing spiritual tips, it should be the time which there is no noise. And I can advise you to do it early in the morning, if it's possible for you. When I'm talking about L in the morning, I'm here to tell you about 4.30 or 5 o'clock a.m. Just until like 10 a.m. That would be the best time ever if in case you want to pray, you want to chant, and also you want to meditate. After you are done, get the time. You already chose the convenient places. Then remember also to have this couple ingredients. Number one, you need to have the rice. And this is the one which you have it today. The rice which you need to use, in, it should be uncooked rice. The rice which is not cooked. In. Find the type of the rice which you have it out there. And then after that, you need to proceed. In. After you already done get the rice with you, you all know that this is my rice, I want to use it today, I want to chant it, I want to meditate, and then after that you need to proceed. The way you can proceed with this one, make sure you need to have another ingredient, which is a lemon or a lime. I used to have the one right here. Okay, I don't see it. Find a lemon or a lime. If you want to ask me which one is very powerful, I can tell you both of it are powerful. Take it and use it just to make sure that you get the amazing result which you are the real ones. After you are done, get the lemon or a lime. Remember to have it also just a cinnamon, especially a cinnamon stick. If you don't have the cinnamon stick, then proceeding with a cinnamon powder. After you are done having a cinnamon powder with you, remember to have it also a sea salt. Other people, they recognize it as a rock salt. If in case you don't know it about, you don't having this type of salt, 
and then when you can proceed in by using pink himalaya salt cooking salt or even table salt so it depends on you which one you have it out there take it and also use it after you are done having a salt with you remember to having a coins i understand there's a lot of people they don't even know about the coins i want to show you what type of the coin that you need to have it the coin which you need to use it, it's super amazing if in case it's happening, you are using a silver coin. If you don't have the silver coin, then you need to go on with a golden coin. You the one which you have it. But if you don't have it, you don't need to stress yourself much. You can proceed in without it and it still will work for you as it works for others. After you are done having all the ingredients. You all know that this is my ingredients. I want to use it today. I want to chant it. I want to meditate. I want to pray just to work for me as it works for others. And then after that, you need to proceed. The way you can proceed with this, our amazing spiritual tips. I recommend you to take everything and keep it just close into you. This will really help you just to stay focused, to concentrate, and to know exactly on what you want to manifest in full. You can choose by your own, either to keep it in front of you, on the side of you, on the back of you, on the table, on the ground, on the floor, it doesn't matter. Any place that I'm feeling for you is convenient. Use that place to pray with it and return back here with a testimony. For instance, you choose it to keep it just in front of you. You're having your rice, your lemon, your salt, your cinnamon stick. Your coin right here. You all know that these are all my things. I want to use it today. I want to chant it to make sure that it's work for me as it work for others. And then after that, you need to proceed. How you can proceed with this one. How you can chant with this one. How you can meditate with this one. Let me tell you, the easiest way to use this all the things together. Very easy and it's very, very simple. Let me show you. First of all, I need to have a small plate like this. Okay, you be using a bowl. There is no problem, but should be anything which you have it. And then after that, I take the rice, the one which I want to use it today, and I put my rice into my cup. You don't, you don't, you don't need to have a lot of it. You don't need to have a lot of rice. You can even have it just a little bit, like the one which I have it in front of this video, just a little bit of rice. And then after we are done adding some rice, and then I take in my salt. And this is the one which I'm using today. I take the salt and I keep it together into this mixture. Remember, when you're adding some, some salt, it should not be a lot. So raw salt should not be very, very visible. You can see there is a salt, like this is a white thing, this is a salt, but it's not very, very visible. Uh, as you can see, it's in real life, when you look like this, you can see if there is a salt. But on the camel, I see it's easy to identify this is a salt and this is a rice. It's very easy to identify it. But you don't need to end up there. Take a little bit of the cinnamon powder and you should uh, sprinkle a cinnamon powder around. I remember one thing which you need to have it. I use always to using uh, a bay leaf. So we take the bay leaves and we dip this first bay leaf. This is the, this is the second bay leaf. And uh, this is a third bay leaves this way. So we just need to add in some bay leaves this way. So around it. Eh? And then after we adding everything around, we just need to drop some coins. If you're having a lot of coin, drop it inside to this mixture. If you don't have a lot, have only one, drop it to one coin. And if you don't have coin at all, don't need to stress. You can just leave it the way it is. And then take the lemon or a lime and you can place somewhere in the middle of this plate place some lemon here and then after you place the lemon on the middle of this mixture then holding it on like this and the starting pray close your eyes i pray in the mighty power of the universe today i believe in a trust i have in a faith from today i want to receiving abundantly in my life and also i want to progress in my all entire life i believe in the mighty power of the universe amen i welcome the financial miracles and the money to flow into me non-stop amen and then after you're done, you need to place this one inside of the house and you can hide it there. Hiding this mixture here there and you can you should have it. If you're having a business, keep it to your business. If you don't have the business you are used to be at home, keep it to your home. If you have the office, keep it to your office. Please, let me tell you. Abundantly, it is here. 
uh, if you want to receive more abundantly more abundance in your life it is here you need to do this and it will help you my name is Kitty Fora and I'm always your spiritual guide. If you want to remove it, this mixture, the day would want feel like you want to remove it, you can remove it. You can put it anywhere which I feel for you. It's convenient. There is no problem. Don't forget to subscribe down below to the red button, which is writing subscribing. And if you are a returning member to my YouTube channel, thank you so much, guys, for always passing by. Don't forget to like the video and also don't forget to share this video to some friend, family, and other groups and telling them you can do this our amazing spiritual guide. Remember, if you really need to support me, support the channel, want to make this channel growing, you can do so by joining through my membership video or by give this video amazing super thanks. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Until next time. And today, guys, let me end up here and I love you all. Bye-bye.